Megan, Hiya. how are you again? You alright? Yeah, I'm good. Well, as good as I can be, I guess. Take me through it, because I know what kind of year you've had. A couple of years, to be honest with you. So to end up out there competing against the best in the world, how does that make you feel? I think every athlete thinks that they'll come back from any injury. You just believe it in yourself. So I think looking back on it, I'll accept that it's been quite a tough battle to get here. But right now, I just thought I'd be better than I was. Um, Today's race was much better executed than yesterday, but I think with the missed training I had, so I didn't have a full winter. I started my winter late because of my Achilles injury and then didn't start my summer early because of my plantar fascia injury. So um, it was just quite difficult missing all, all both, both ends of it, really. So I, I'm happy to be here and once in a lifetime, really, opportunity. Well, three for our country, but for most athletes, it's one. It'll be my only one home games so um, I'm thrilled to be able to come here and see how the crowd and I was gonna say given what you've been through did you really expect to achieve much more than you did or I mean what were your expectations I was hoping to come here and run a 55 seconds I know that's well within my reach I just think how I qualified is just a bit too difficult I think had it been four weeks later it'd have been a different story um, I was even waiting to know if I qualified I was the last qualifier and it was sort of the Wednesday and it was three days of absolute agony waiting like to see if I got in and then I kind of I had some good training sessions but I just didn't quite have the zip really tonight I don't I, I usually go off much faster I think than that I've not seen it yet but I didn't feel like I had the zip I normally would have um but does this, does this competing out here whet your appetite to do it again for more yeah definitely I just want to come and compete at the best of my ability I think it's sometimes hard to come and do something below par because I'm looking at those times thinking that's why I was in my reach I've done that I've done those times a lot I've done them in in this stadium around 55 like I know that I'm capable of it so it's just quite difficult to see it and then not be where you are but there's so many other athletes that are in the same boat and I guess you just can't there's all but every athlete has their own journey and then loads of things go wrong so you can't really ever expect it to run smoothly and a lot of the athletes here have had great competitions or bad ones and like I think it's hard as it has a team but everyone just pulled together and kind of pulls each other through and I know I know that like we'll all, the ones that didn't do so well we'll all want to pick ourselves up and achieve something in the Commonwealth or Europeans or something next year. So the crowd were edging, egging you on. Talk, talk to me about what that's like when you're racing, just before when you're starting. It is great. They're so loud and like you walk in past everyone, they go, "Go on, Megan!" And I'm just thinking, "Oh my God, you know my name." This is exciting. So it, it's just great to have that opportunity and the, the, the screams that you get. You just feel like an absolute superstar. It's an unlucky today. I'm sure you'll be back soon. Though, don't worry. Thank you. Cheers.